Now, I know what you're thinking. I was at Farthing Shrine. Well, this guy has a key, and I think that's the key we can use to unlock that door. Oh, there you are. Still keeping your marbles all together? Then go ahead. Never hurts to splur. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're crazy, man. If I'm correct. This should be the key we need, so... Uh, doesn't say anything about the lower undead berg, but still the undead berg. We're gonna find out. Anything else we have actually new? Uh, nothing new. No. Ah, of course, nothing new. Tch, throw me a bone, will you? You haven't got much time anyway. Right, Julia? Julia. Who's Yulia? I'm not sure actually. But yeah. But anyway, guys, it's Dark in here. Welcome back to Dark Souls. Last time we explored most of the Undead Berg, uh, the lower end of it, a lot of, de a lot of dogs and, uh, and rogues with bleed everywhere. But yeah. So what I'm going to do is meet you guys at the uh, lower end of Berg and see if that key actually works. So until then, I was right. You are trapped in here, huh? Alright. Break every barrel! Okay, not you, apparently. Oh, sorcerer gear. Gee, I wonder who you are. Brilliant. You opened the door for me. Thank you. I'm saved. I thought I might never escape. I am Griggs of Vinheim. A sorcerer of the school. I am much obliged for your assistance. Thanks to you, I may now resume my travels. Well, aren't you nice? Oh, hello. I'm fine. I will rest a while, then return to Firelink Shrine. I have my sorcery. And I will be more cautious next time. Besides, I have an important task at hand. So, you're a sorcerer, but you couldn't open a door? Okay. That's new. Oh, hello. I'm fine. All right, I have all right. my sword. Besides, I have... Alright, now that we got this guy out, we can now proceed to the boss. So, I will meet you guys at the fog gate. Oh, well, look who's back, actually. Huh. Oh, hello. I regret meeting you under such compromising circumstances. At least we both made it back unscathed. Incidentally, would you care to learn any sorceries? You're clearly talented, and besides, I owe you. Of course, we will require some materials, but I am happy to teach you some elementary spells. Are you interested? I mean, yeah, why not? Sure. Splendid. Very well. I am pleased to have a chance to give something back. Well then, let's get started straight away. Hmm, no. Dialogue. Have you heard of Big Hat Logan? Maybe. Master Logan is a great sorcerer and my teacher. Both of us came to this land as undead. But one day, he departed, leaving only a note. I suppose he wished to keep me out of harm's way. Probably. But where does that leave me? I have dedicated myself to sorcery. But Master Logan could find no use for me. Poor guy. But maybe Logan wanted him away from this, in case, you know, he may go nutty? Ah, uh, yes. The note that Master Logan left. It only said he would travel to Anolondo by way of Sen's fortress. Huh. I can only guess that he seeks the regal archives. For Master Logan is a tireless pursuer of wisdom. Wisdom trumps all. Everything else is hogwash. When the curse turned him undead, I'm certain that he only felt it was the perfect chance to visit this land. I only wish that I had his courage. Okay. So, a little bit new dialogue there. Of two places, possibly. Something about a library, and then something called a place called Sense Fortress. Well, we'll probably end up dealing with those places later on in the game, but for now, more talking. Two things are required for sorcery. First, you must equip a wand. Second, you must attune a sorcery. Then you will be ready to fire away. Oh, and don't forget to aim. Do I have to aim? I thought it was auto-click and win. 
Two things are required. Okay. Set then. Oh, and. All right, what do you got? Soul arrow, heavy soul arrow, great soul arrow, heavy soul arrow. Oh, wow. Oh. Hey. I mean, I wasn't going to go much into sorcery, but I might go now. Hey. He's some good stuff, actually. Catalyst. Oh wow, they actually, he actually gives you both the rings? Oh man! <laughs> oh wow, okay. Because I'm playing in Dark Souls 3 when my character is a mage. So like these rings are like, dumb! But like, expensive! So... Hmm... How much is Soul Arrow? 1,000. Well, I'll probably end up grinding souls to get magic eventually later on. But for now, we'll just level up. Goodbye then. Do stay safe. Yeah, no worries. So now we have a, a source will teach us stuff now, which is nice. So, let's level up. Only one more time. Let's go for that endurance. I want that equipment load light as possible because I want to use heavy har armor or, you know, big weapons. So, in that case, more stamina, more equipment loads, always necessary. Alrighty, so now that's over with, I will now meet you guys at the Capra Demon. And we're here. <sighs> now, this guy's not fun. I'll put it this way. And we go. First of all, run away. Oh, oh, oh god. Service up the dogs if you can. Oh crap. If you get the dogs away from me, he's okay. He's not too bad. Oh man. Uh. And there's a death. Uh. Alright, round two. Here we go. Oh, crap! <sighs> Again! Round three. Oh, thanks, I'm not dealing with this right now. Really? That's gonna hurt. Can I draw? Can we draw, please? I'm dead, alright. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. <sighs> you gotta be kidding me, right? Uh, five, I think now. Down. Okay, this should be good now. Come on. Ah. Uh. Alright, uh, the time of recording this is getting late, so to be honest, I'm just going to end it here. What I'll probably end up doing is grinding off screen, or uh, maybe adjust my equipment or something, I don't know. So, uh, I'm pretty sure you guys love me dying a bunch. Pretty sure you guys like that. Uh, but yeah, that was... I'm going to put this right out there. The Capra Demon himself is legitimately easy. I'm not making it look easy because I'm dying left and right, but legit, he's actually easy. 
the dogs would make them hard, to be honest, because the dogs can just stun lock you to death, and at that point, he can just finish you off. Like, Lily had little health, and I kill the dogs, and then he just struck her down. Because there's a method to what you do. You kill the dogs, so it fights a lot easier, the dogs can't stun lock you while he gets you, and then there's a method you can kill him afterwards. But, you know, I had to get past the dogs first. Oh. I don't remember being this tough, but I think I summoned during that time because, like, again, I played this before, but mostly on the uh, console. So I was like, ooh, summons, yeah, sure, why not? So now I'm doing one on one. It's like, you know, harder because with people, you can uh, distract the dogs, but you can deal with the boss or vice versa. But on your own, a little difficult. But, um, yeah, that's. That's it for now, so next time you guys see me, I maybe have some different equipment on, higher level. So until then guys, this is Darkson, signing off.